Hey, what's up, bosses? Cartland here with the Truck Boss Show. We're in Tonkawa, Oklahoma at the Bust and Knuckle Truck Show. And we're sitting here with Sean Gibson, an Oklahoma, or a Broken Bow, Oklahoma native, where I'm actually from. And he's been showing us some of his awesome trucks. And right now, we're on three out of four. Tell us about it. Yes, sir. This actually is a number 15 classic. It's all original, other than the paint. On a scale from one to 10, this truck right here, actually, when I looked at it, I would say it was a seven or eight. And we've tried to bring it around to make it as new as possible we can without just, you know, taking disassembling the truck. It is, it's still original wheelbase, still has original interior, uh, engine, transmission, rear ends, everything about it is all original. This truck right here is probably one of the tightest riding, driving 359s that I actually own. And actually Brent here at uh, Wilkins Trucks, they, uh, they put the truck together some years back and then I found out about it and then being 15, that's my favorite number. And when I found out it was number 15, I just had to purchase it. And I like to show you the inside of this truck to show you just how original it actually is. Perfect, let's see it. This, it's hard to find a truck of this statue, you know, with a gray interior, because usually over the years that they would usually turn or be torn or ripped up and tore up, you know? Oh, I like it. The classic look is, it's hard to beat. Yes, sir, it is. It's just got that old school feel. Yep, and you said that you, this is actually your first year at the Bust and Knuckle Truck Yes, sir, show, right? it is. The reason we came up is if you look around here at the show, you'll see more older trucks than you do the newer stuff. And these guys here have a passion for older, you know, older trucks like I do here at Wilkins. And I just, uh, they asked me if I'd come up, you know, uh, I'd purchased four trucks off of Brett this past year, 359s. Uh, I, I bought the last glider that was uh, ever rolled out of the factory that never had been assembled from Brett. That's the first truck I actually purchased. Since then, I've purchased three more from him. They're good folks to deal with. I really appreciate them. They're putting on a heck of an event here this weekend, too. They are, and it is, it is packed. This is my first truck show, actually. We've been with the Truck Boss Show for a whole year. And this is the first one that didn't get canceled by COVID, so we're enjoying it. Um, and you've got one more truck to show yes, us, Yes, sir, right? we'll show you one more. We Let's have four here out. in the fleet this weekend. 